So this is the North Regional Laboratory. We serve the Northern Region. Um, this is one of the largest areas for drug submissions in the state of New Jersey. So now we're entering into the secured lab space. Um, so this is our uh, evidence vault here. Uh, so all of our evidence, once it's received at the front desk, um, we have evidence handlers that will have access to the vault to retrieve evidence for the scientists that are working on evidence, and they'll also return it when the scientists are done uh, with their analysis. Uh, the Forensic Science and Technology section of the Investigations Branch, commanded by Major Ron Walter, is committed to not only processing evidence for prosecution, but turning that evidence into actionable and timely intelligence as well. So here we have our first uh, instrumentation bag. This is our drug bag. We currently have one GC mass spec validated and ready for a uh, casework analysis. Um, so this uh, GC mass spec gas chromatograph mass spectrometer uh, is what we do uh, use for our drug analysis where we'll able, be able to compare it to a reference material to determine uh, the contents of the drugs. Uh, right now what's hot in New Jersey is fentanyl, uh, cocaine, methamphetamine. This bag here is for our toxicology staff. Uh, very much like the drug unit, they're using the gas chromatograph mass spectrometer. They're extracting blood and urine and preparing samples to be run on the GC mass spec to determine if there's any drugs, comparing drugs um, in the samples. This bag here is where we do our blood alcohol analysis. Uh, so blood alcohol uh, is extracted with an internal standard and we actually do a calibration curve. Uh, from that calibration curve, we can determine the quantity of ethyl alcohol in the sample and determine if somebody is under the influence of alcohol. This here is the ELISA. So the ELISA is a screening tool that we use uh, for our impaired drugs. And we can actually determine um, what drugs are in a blood or a urine. Given the real-time nature of police work uh, now, uh, we, want that, we want that evidence as quickly as possible to be processed. So in order to do that, we have to make it convenient for the police departments. There's 565 police departments in the state of New Jersey. So we've broken up labs uh, regionally. This is the north region, and we anticipate uh, processing approximately uh, 12,000 pieces of evidence in the, in the coming year.